I think we made a couple of errors in the game, if I'm honest. I thought we'd play our effort and Endeavour was brilliant. And we started off like house on fire. Um, but we just, oh, our discipline's been pretty good, but just a couple of crucial errors we made and uh, kept them in the game. So in the end, we were disappointed with the draw. I thought we did enough to win, but probably the story of our season so far. Like. Does a game like that signify just how fine the margins have been in the Premiership this season? Well, yeah, they do. But what really signifies it is the fact that Newcastle are a good side, are going down. You know, it's been highly competitive, and you know, with London Irish coming up as well next year, it's not going to be any easier. So, I think the league's is going to be as competitive as this for the for the for the foreseeable future. Final game of the season coming up, week on Saturday against Gloucester. Just talk to me about the mindset heading into that game, and. What needs to happen in order for us to get top six? Well, we need to win ultimately, and and hope we can win better than Bath win if they beat Leicester. It's, it's had our hands to a certain extent, um, but you know we're, we're not taking half off the gas. We're, we're um, our training schedule is is as it should be. Uh, we've got one last rep, as we say, uh, left in the gym, and uh, that's a week on Saturday against Gloucester and. Pretty much apart from Marlon Yard and Cam Neal, we should be picking from a full strength squad if Rowan and um, Byron come through, which we were fingers crossed we're hopeful of. Also, you know, we're, we're in a good position, let's be perfectly honest. You know, we've, we've, we're playing at home. Gloucester are a formidable team, but you know, if we get it right, we can beat them at home.